about to blow y'all mind because they're literally putting it in our face. So you're telling me we're still denying the existence of melanated Afro people in America pre-Columbus? I hope y'all know what's going on in the Grand Canyon. We have Sphinx statues in the Grand Canyon. Hieroglyphics! Oh, you see that other statue? There is an Egyptian temple named after an Egyptian goddess in the Grand Canyon. I'm pretty sure everybody has seen the Great Seal of California. You see that Amazon warrior who is depicted as white? Well, the original seal of 1510 was an actual melanated Afro woman. And her name was Queen Calafia, hence California. There have been depictions of her in caves, but you know they well wash everything. I'm gonna let the goddess explain. Calafia was described as a black warrior queen who ruled the mythical island of California. The island was inhibited only by black women who lived like Amazon warriors. Um, what? California could have possibly been ruled by black women? Y'all know Las Vegas, right? That's right next to California and Arizona where the Grand Canyon is. We talked about these Egyptian artifacts, crypts, all of that found in the Grand Canyon. Remember how I said they put it in our face without actually telling us? There's a spot in Vegas called Luxor with a pyramid, a sphinx, and Egyptian statues. They also have a museum that shows mock artifacts of Egyptians. I mean, come on. I'ma just show you an up close and personal picture. We also got skulls that resemble Afro people found in pre-Columbus layers in Mexico and Texas. And you can say, oh, maybe they just wanted to build it right there just because. But in all honesty, I'm not going for that. Every monument that's placed everywhere has a specific reason why it's there. There is sacred geometry and architecture that they don't want to tell us. Specific places like Washington, D.C., they put them in specific areas for a reason. So I'm not going for this. I want to know what y'all think, though, because all of this is not adding up, but it's adding up. So stay dangerous and keep your first eye open.